We are seeing wild weather all across Northern California with lightning, thunder and rain, something that we have not seen in months around here in the North Bay neighborhood in Ronit Park cleaning up this morning after the storm caused some major damage. Now you're looking at Becky Court. A resident says lightning struck a pine tree and that caused it to topple over onto his home and two vehicles and you can see those are done for. He says it sounded like a bomb exploded. PG&E cut power to the neighborhood until some of that debris can be removed out of there. Uh, they also need to inspect the power pole close to that pine tree. And take a look at this video. This is out of the East Bay. There was at least one lightning strike in Bay Point last night, and really this weather has firefighters on high alert. They're watching to see if these lightning strikes spark any wildfires. ABC 7 News reporter Amy Hollyfield joining us live in, in the East Bay now with how the crews are preparing and what they've seen so far. Amy. Kamasi, we're at a high point up in Concord and we got quite a show. It has just started to slow down, but for a couple of hours there, we were just constantly saying, did you see that one? Did you see that one? Here's some video of the show. We saw big bursts of light overnight that just lit up the whole sky. We also saw those zigzag bolts of lightning. We are at a high point in Concord looking northwest. We also captured a strike. This is while driving on 680 in Danville. And we're hearing from viewers about some rain too in this storm. Five minutes of a downpour in Martinez, rain in the North Bay as well. And that could make Make a huge difference this morning because even though we haven't heard of any fires from these strikes, firefighters worry about what they can't see. The challenge for lightning, like I said, is um, it happens in remote locations with poor access and that allows those fires to get big before we can get stuff on them. And here is a look at some more lightning from overnight. This was in Santa Rosa. It was a busy night of activity all over the Bay Area and firefighters were watching it very carefully. Some monitoring it from their emergency operations centers. They're ready to go and they say you should be too. Those evacuation plans and bags should be ready if this turns into a dangerous situation. So far it has been just a show. No major problems reported at this time.